Joining us now, live in downtown Tulsa with more, Kim. Well, not everyone is feeling hospitable. Some people feel like the last thing Oklahoma needs is more visitors and more COVID. This is our original, and this is a really, uh, this is one of our hottest sellers. At Black Wall Street Teas and Souvenirs, it's been a great year for business with all eyes on the historic Black Wall Street District. The amount of people that we see each and every day from in-state, out-of-state, around the country, out of country, it's, it's been a miracle and amazing. And Cindy Cosper expects even more tourists with the upcoming centennial anniversary of the 1921 race massacre. Um, and when they come in, they always have their masks on. We have plenty of sanitizer for people and so um, we think we you know we sanitize we we uh, make sure that everything is cleaned up daily I'm governor Kevin Stitt now governor Kevin Stitt has issued an invitation to tourists for open adventure as many battle COVID-19 there's been so much sacrifice and him selecting to invite more COVID into our community during a time when there's already a surge is just a smack in the face to everyone who's sacrificed or lost someone. Laura Bell is co-founder of Save Our State, feels that people should stay home just like the CDC recommends. I know so many folks have right given up holiday travel plans or time with family. I know I have. But the doors are open at Black Wall Street Tees and many other businesses. We can't be afraid. We can be cautious. Uh, but we can't be afraid to live life. I mean, your life just doesn't stop uh, just because, you know, there's a pandemic. Um, and so people just have to be able to carry on with what they're doing. But just be safe and cautious about it. Be smart, uh, but don't be afraid. Trying to find a balance during hard times. And Oklahoma listed on the on the Forbes list of risky places to visit during the holidays for us not having a mask mandate and for the number of daily cases. Live in downtown Tulsa, Kim Jackson, News Channel 8.